Hi Taurus, the Awakened Dreamer here to give you your mid-month money and career tarot reading for the month of June 2022. Thank you so much for joining me. Do keep in mind this is general for the remainder of your month and surrounding it, so just take what resonates and leave the rest behind. But as well, I do want to remind you uh, to show some love and support. Didn't mean to say it that way by liking this video, leaving me a comment or several down below, and of course subscribing to the channel if you haven't done so already. They're saying catch your breath. I feel like you're doing a lot of speaking, having to go on rants, explain, teach, help in the next um, couple of weeks. I sense that you are a leader in a lot of ways, okay? And it's quite evident in the second half of the month. Um, but I do also want to remind you that you're a rock star, okay? Um, didn't mean to say that, but let's do some shuffling and pull it from the Guilds of Terrell. People are going to remind you that you're great at what you do. People are going to praise you, compliment you. So eat it up is what's coming through for Taurus. I do sense a bit of annoyance, right? When it comes to background noise, when it comes to other energies, um, while others do satisfy you and make you laugh, you enjoy their presence, there's going to be at least one, if not, um, this is meant to be in the upright, bear with me. There's going to be one person in each situation you're wrapped up in, if not multiple people, energies that rub you the wrong way or just irritate you in some in some sort of uh, way. Anyways, moving right along, I do feel like you could be very empathic being drawn to this reading. So make sure to cleanse your energy and be strategic as to who you socialize with or just... Um, hang around in your downtime all right even though i feel like there's very rare moments of um downtime but with the king of cups at the bottom of the deck in reverse i truly feel like you are confident but you're lacking the emotion that could potentially weigh down your manifestation process as i feel like you have a lot you're trying to accomplish at this time and one big goal i feel the need to say if not multiple goals within one's mind heart and soul that will be accomplished if you so choose to keep pursuing them but i really feel like um you're showing people how to manifest i'm hearing predictive nature you really could find that you are just easily predicting or just um assuming in the right direction in the second half of the month but we have the world card and the devil at the center of your reading now the world card was in reverse and i feel like you're going from what feels like stagnancy lack of progression it may feel like things weren't changing um feeling prevented in a lot of ways and they're saying blockages are being removed. You're finding that your world's changing for the better. You're going to find this strut come about you, this pep in your step, jumping out of bed in the morning to accomplish what you need to. Most of the mornings, right? Um, every day can't be perfect. But you're being viewed as someone very angelic, very calm, grounded. Um, someone who does have their emotions but isn't feeling them as strongly or at all in comparison to the first half of the month or before then i truly feel like the strength within you is quite evident as you're overworked okay now there could be a level of overthinking but i do sense that spirit is assisting you with that by um being within your mind okay a reminder throughout the second half of the month for you uh taurus for some of you that or you could be reminding others that spirit speaks through your thoughts and it sounds like you Okay. What else do we have for Taurus? I'm hearing stop speaking and breathe. I feel like you need to catch your breath once again. Um, and it may help others take a moment to digest what you're saying, what you're trying to convey, teach, or just it might help um, them come up with a new realization or something to add to what you're teaching them. Okay. Okay, we have the Queen of Swords. Did you feel how easy those came out? How peaceful it was, even though there was some um, uneasy energy in the background? I do feel as if you are the peace in the situation, or you're just feeling, or more than one, or you're feeling as if things are peaceful within you and even um, very closely surrounding you, um, angelically, okay? Um, a lot of ums, bear with me. But I do sense that there are certain factors, energies that are adding chaos to a situation 
or multiple, you're going to find that you're very mysterious. People are, they're highlighting people within a work situation or a living situation that are not trustworthy, okay? I really feel like you need to be careful as to what you speak around people, what you, okay, they're saying gossip, um, and who you open up to. Doesn't mean you shouldn't open up in general, but I do feel like that is being highlighted for a reason. It could um, be detrimental to the future um, of your business or the future of your company um, or, or the future of your your career path with a company. Anyways, um, I do sense that you're very spiritually connected with the High Priestess within the second half of the month in the midst of going through a balancing act. I really just blanked out, okay? And that's going to happen to you. I really sense that you are... Um, unsure at certain points, but then reminded by spirit in the universe that you're more sure than you think, right? Your intuition, your instincts quite on point, and it's going to be proven worthy. You're going to predict something or guess something, and people are going to be in awe. You will manifest something minuscule, and it will prove that you can manifest on, on a large schedule, um, interesting, on a larger scale. So it's something about um, a large schedule for work or even your large schedule as far as all you have to accomplish. I feel like there's too much on your plate, but you can handle it. Feeling like a wounded warrior and just uh, burnt out, okay? It's as if you just do what you got to do and you do it well. Very mature. Doing your best to be on time, to be early. I feel as if things are falling into place for you. And you're thinking about your family when you're at work for whatever reason. Not a ton of time to socialize or to catch up with your loved ones but I do feel like things are transforming for you by the day. If you're a business owner, wow, that business is thriving, okay? And if you work a part-time job or even a full-time job with a company, you are showing people how it's done, period, okay? Money's flowing in quite nicely is what I just heard. Let's put these up here. And with the Queen of Swords at the bottom, I feel like there is a feistiness about you at times, a sassiness. Um, a defensiveness maybe uh, for a select few drawn to this reading. Thinking about on one end, um, underneath it all, what you want to get rid of, what you want to cut out, potentially push to think about habits that are costing too much money or aren't benefiting your health as you do have to make sure you can persevere in the best, most productive way possible. But I feel like you are bringing the sassiness out in others as well, respecting people when they can just have fun within a chaotic situation or just a busy filled situation Ooh, i just split the deck for a reason six of pentacles we're going to take it i feel like people are gifting you okay a lot of abundance in the second half of the month to be a taurus is to be strong is to to lead the way it's to show people you can work smarter not harder you can be peaceful all the meanwhile all right Let's do some more shuffling. When you feel the need to do it again or to do it over, just do it, okay? You will thank yourself in the end as it will come out 10 times better or there's just another reason, another benefit. Synchronicity is my friend. Wow, spirits communicating. You're going to see angel numbers. They just showed me 1111, 1010. Uh, 10. Abundance, my friend. Abundance. You are going to feel as if Spirit so present uh, that you see synchronicities left and right. You look up, you look down, you look to the left, you look to the right, and you see something else. Uh, I feel a full body of goosebumps right now. You don't be surprised if you experience just that. There's a wish fulfillment taking place in the near future, and I feel like you're on your way to greatness once again. You're There's this feeling of uh, cheers to us, cheers to a hard day's work, to making money. I really feel like people respect you in a situation and that's going to benefit you greatly. If you want an extra shift, you've got it. If you want an extra opportunity to make money, you've got it. Again, you're a manifesting machine. I do sense that um, people are a bit jealous as well, but that jealousy isn't going to bring things down or alter the progress that's taking place. I do feel like... Um, Okay, they're showing a thumbs up, but first they showed a thumbs down. Um, jealousy is now what I'm hearing as far as the thumbs down. I, it could be on social media like YouTube, but I do feel like your social media presence is quite strong, all right? You're being moved up in the ranks is what I'm hearing in more than one way. 
potentially in more than one situation. But I feel like in the midst of chaos, I feel like you are um, expecting to have to defend what you want to invest in or begin within your money and career. Money is on your mind and you're making a ton of it, period. All right. So don't let people make you feel as if your priorities are all out of whack or you just uh, are moving in the wrong direction because you're about to give birth to a new move of residence and or a new job in the future and it's meant for you period even if something could have a future it's not meant to do you see how when i put the cards down in between speaking i'm not feeling rushed naturally that's you all right quite independent and just doing what you got to do showing people again how it's done thinking about releasing oneself from certain restrictions or just um not wanting to be tied down but in certain ways you are in the second half of the month but it benefits you you have a lot to accomplish but when you accomplish it you celebrate all right or you feel as if you just have the sense of reward right fulfillment satisfaction you are on point things feel even um as i just saw 11 on the dot for the timestamp, i really feel like you're also thinking about the past out of preparation for change in the future. It's going to be a very abundant um, second half of June for you. So embrace it and try not to um, to take on too much more as I feel like there's already a lot going on and on your plate moving into the second half of the month. You are going to be so successful, okay? So I hope this reading was truly helpful. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Go have yourself an amazing rest of June. And I'll see you next time. Bye, Taurus.